Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the dark side of stable diffusion. Literally. Are your eyes begging for mercy after staring at that blinding white UI of automatic 1111 while using stable diffusion? Well, today, we're going to turn this blinding UI into a sleek, dark theme by changing one simple setting. Before we begin, make sure Stable Diffusion is not running. First, go to your Stable Diffusion directory and locate the webuser.bat file. You know, the file we use to run Automatic 1111. Yeah, that one. Right-click that bad boy and choose Show More Options. Then, click Edit to open it up in Notepad. Now, here comes the magic. Find the line that says Set Command Line Args. Type double dash theme, dark right after this line. This line is your key to eternal darkness, well at least for your stable diffusion interface. Save the file and close notepad. Now run stable diffusion again. Bask in the glorious glow of the dark theme. Your eyes will thank you. But wait, there's more. Want a complete theme makeover? Head to the Settings page and click on the User Interface menu. See that Gradio theme drop-down? That's your playground. Pick a theme, any theme, and click Apply Settings and reload the UI. Boom! You've just transformed your Stable Diffusion into something totally new. There are so many options you can choose from. Some are really good, whereas some are… just alright. Either way. That's how you can enable dark mode in Stable Diffusion and change your entire interface theme. With dark mode and a plethora of themes at your fingertips, you can now create art in an environment that's both comfortable and inspiring. If you have any questions, leave a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos on Stable Diffusion. Until next time, happy creating!